Now, when it comes to how many shots a patient gets, is there a limit? How many they can? Okay, in terms of, um, we go based on on in, on, on on literature. So typically, mm -hmm. um, that's a very good question that we get all the time. Statistically speaking, when we're talking about the epidural injection, it takes 1.7 injections per patient for them to feel better. So we do one, and we see how the patient responds. Right. So. Our main important thing will be just immediately after the patient undergoes the procedure, they should get relief. That's the local anesthetic component from the injection. Then the local anesthetic wears down and normally the steroids start kicking in within okay. two days up to two weeks from the injection. That's when we go ahead and we see the patient back two weeks after the injection mm -hmm. just to reassess. If the patient tells us that they are feeling great, obviously that's, that's the end of it. Now if the patient tells us, I feel great but not where I want, right. we go ahead and we can proceed with a second injection. How so far in between? Two to three weeks from the, okay. uh, from the prior injection is just for the cumulative effect of the steroid. Mm -hmm. Now, um, and, 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 and some patients, they might get three injections. It can happen, but it, right. we don't have a, like a set rule that we have to do three injections that some, some people might hear. Um, now, if the patient comes back and they tell me, I got great improvement for a day or two, but now my pain came back. I know that the, that the sim, that that's where the right area where the injection was done, but the, the steroid itself didn't take care of the inflammation in the long term. Mm -hmm. Very unlikely if I do a second, a third, a fourth, a tenth injection, we're going to achieve any right. outcomes. Those are the patients that we might seek a surgical consultation for, for mm -hmm. those. They might benefit from that. Also, we look at time. So let's say best case scenario, one or two injections give you two months worth of relief. Again, that's not impacting your quality of life, that's affecting your quality right. of life, and those patients, they might, is advisable more of a surgical intervention. We look more for a six months mark or more for those patients that we can repeat the injections afterwards. So, mm -hmm. in, in, so that's why the famous number, about three to four injections a year, will be valuable, taking into consideration this, uh, the six months mark, helping them out, and they, the patient is agreeable that they're okay with it, it's, they're, they don't wanna pursue any surgical intervention, and they just wanna, they can, they're happy living with it and they are, and they are able to have a functional life.